Okay, I wanted to do a video on water. And, you know, in my last video I mentioned, you know, that I'm kind of going back to the basics of, you know, food, water, shelter, um, and a way to protect that. That's kind of what I see as my level one um, prepping. And, you know, I, so I have some of these, these, water, these uh, bottles of water here, and we do rotate those. And then I have a few um, over here you know, um, of water, and I, there's some more around here, but I, I, when you think about a gallon per person per day, it's a lot of water, so, and I know that these don't last that terribly long, I guess the plastic will break down a year, two years, is, is what I've been told, so I wanted to look at, for water storage, um, the, the, the way to filter it, and I saw a, a really good video on these uh, basically building a, a Berkey water filter and you know um, and so what I did is I bought um, I got this on eBay actually it's one of those candlestick um, water filters and I can't remember exactly how much it was I think maybe 30 bucks and I also got I, I, I saw this on another video and I really like this one this is basically the same thing although it's more of a dome but it's the same type of filter. It comes with the, you know, the, the nozzle and the, the washers. So what you do is, um, and I'll show you where I got this in a second. This goes in in here. So you drill a hole in the bottom of this top bucket and then in the in the lid. So you know, you put water up here. It's going to filter through this, drip into the bottom bucket. Then what you get with this. Uh, is you get this spigot so we can put the spigot in down here and you got nice clean water I don't remember exactly how much these things can filter for some reason I want to say 3,000 gallons it's a bunch of water so if you got 3,000 gall gallons 3,000 gallons you know that's that's a pretty good deal now I got this one at um, the monolithic marketplace it's uh, shop.monolithic.com I'll try to remember to put the uh, the, the link uh, in the notes below. Now, how much was that one? It was twenty-seven fifty. Now, the twenty-seven fifty was because I got this, the spigot. If I didn't get spigot, I think it was only twenty-one fifty for for the filter itself, plus shipping. So thirty-six fifty. So and and it gives you the instructions on how to do it. How about that? So I really like that one. Um, I uh, I was able to get some buckets. Uh, my brother actually owns a pizza place, so I think these had uh, banana peppers or pickles and things like that. So I was actually just getting ready to wash these out, and I thought, well, I'll go ahead and make a video on, on the water. Now, in my last video also, I talked about having the, um, the bulk food, and I got this stuff from the LDS store. I also got one of these, um, the filtered, um, the filtered uh, bottle. So it has the filter in there. You know, it has your straw built in. Put water in it. Drink it. It's filtered. And it even comes with an extra filter. I can't remember exactly how much that was either. Um, $21, $22. But that's the, the box that it came in. So, you know, that's a couple hundred gallons there. So when you think about the gallon per person per day, this here is actually a whole lot less expensive and a whole lot more convenient to store than actually having thousands of gallons of water. Now, the one thing you have to have, and I do have access to water, there's streams close by, I have the rain buckets, or the barrels that, you know, collect in the, the, um, the gutter water outside, so, so I, I feel like I have the water, so I thought this could work. So anyway, I just wanted to share this with you. Um, any thoughts, uh, let me know. Take care, thanks.